Well, how do the chums as I, Captain Steven, today chums for you guys in the viewer verse. I'm going to be making some gra jam. Yes, gra is in gra berry or gra is in Viking sort of, I don't know, chant, I guess, in a roundabout way. Right, first we need to find a radioactive world or gamma planet, so I need to select gamma root from my catalogue. That will put that into my sweep scanner. And yes, you can see there, there's not a planet inside of this system, or else it would say there is a planet inside of this system. I have to go to the galactic map and hop to another area of space so here we go let's jump in my spaceship handy dandy spaceship for traveling into space yes let's head on up into the space and let's go into the galactic map because yes and let's call on up and hopefully we shall see yeah, a location pinpointed to us yes there we go look little green line yes current mission and that is for my gamma route you can see it there on the little menu and we're jumping through the space and time and hopefully going to arrive in a system with gamma root to be had. Heck yes, we are chums. Now this method works with any of those plants. If I wanted to find a lush planet, I would select starbolt. If I wanted to find a frost planet, I would select frost crystal or frost wart. Only fudge. What the fudge in the heck's going on here? There is a battle going on. Oh, and one of these freighters to the right of me has got one of those big ball type heads to it, which is pretty darn cool. Space Odyssey, eat your heart out. Take that, you ruffian, you pirate, you scallywag. I have fired a rocket into your chassis. Why have you not exploded? Explode, dang you! There we go. I love those breaks noises kaboom you're toasticated right okay and there was another one there you want to become space rubble there you are there you are your wish has been achieved space rubble you are pick up those lovely canisters magnetize ferrite for me heck yes and a rocket for you sir yeah is that a, is that a bad guy yes it is kaboom you're dead heck yes you are rockets have a massive range people even if you're going up against a god tier ship you can hit them with a rocket or two before they get to you and therefore disabling their shields with one rocket blast i mean you can just swap to your positron and take them out if you're super lucky yes a normal ship against a god tier ship doesn't stand much of a chance but against these guys these little npcs easy as pie unless they're hiding inside the freaking confines of the freaking freighter yeah, so here we go, let's spin this around. Hopefully we can pick this little guy off. Right, take this, you. Boom, take that, you ruffian. Yes, how dare you attack that fretter. Boom, you're dead. Congratulations, you're now space junk. Right, we're done. Okay, we well, let's take on the hail. Let's see what this guy has to say. Hello there, my little Corvix jam. What's that? You want me to be a captain? I'm already a captain of a vessel. It's much better than the one you've got on offer. Thank you very much. Right, okay, we've got this ring planet down here, which happens to be the Gamma Root planet. And I can see that it says activated copper. The planet at the moment is swarmed in clouds, which means I'm going to be landing at a time of a storm. Now, when you see the words activated in there, it does mean that it's a very extremely type stormy planet. So I'm not going to be putting a base kitchen on this planet. Heck no, I'm not. I'm going to continue my search for another Gamma Root planet in the same way that I just did by using my catalogue and selecting Gamma and hopefully finding a more majestic sort of planet than this. One that isn't going to eat me alive as I stand upon its surface no because the only place that you're gonna find a gra root grown in the wilds or gra berry i should say gra berry yeah there's no such thing as gra root yes yeah, so gra berries they grow upon planets like this upon a gamma weld is where you're gonna find them this is a lovely gamma weld though look at this this is freaking beautiful it's all wavy davy it's got lots of moving flora heck yes it has oh it's got some little striders on here as well hmm i might build a kitchen on this planet Hmm, okay, well, let's see if I can find the Grabberry. Are you Grabberry? Holy fudge! There's a lot of lightning going on here, people. Let's just hope I don't get hit by the lightnings. Whoa, that was freaking closed. Okay, right, um, and there we go. One sweet root. No, that's not it. And Grabberry! Holy fudge and heck! Oh my days! That nearly hit me. Holy heck! That oh fudge! That had my freaking eye out. Freaking electric bolt to the freaking head. Did you see that, chums? Freaking Zeus and his lightning bolt chucking antics. You get Zeus. I will have you one day. Yes, right. Let's head on over here. I think it was Zeus. Was it Zeus or was it Odin? It might be Odin or it could even be Thor. Who knows? With all these mythological lightning bolt chuckers. Right, there we go. I've got myself a Grand Barret. 
Lovely. And yes, I got five grab berries in that one batch. Now I would just throw down a nutrient processor if this world wasn't so freaking dangerous. But no, I'm going to jump back to the Nexus. I'm going to jump back to one of my kitchens and hopefully spin this into gra juice. Oh, no, not gra juice. Gra jam. That's the whole video. Gra jam. It's in the freaking title, Steve. Learn to freaking read. Right, let's go on up into here and let's call in the Nexus. Are we in range? No. Fudge and heck. Okay, well, let's pulse again. Just a little tiny pulse. Chicka boom. Now let's call in the Nexus. Hooray and hurrah! We've got our own Death Star! Awesome! Gra Berry Jam will be ours. There's no berry in there either, Steve, is there? It's just Gra Jam, for fudge's sake. Right, let's head on in and let's go up to the teleporter and let's hit on up one of my kitchenette bases where we can turn this Gra Berry into Gra Jam. I <laughs> yes, I got it right at freaking last. So you're taking three attempts. Right, brilliant. Let's jump on out of my ship. Lovely jubbly. So yeah, Gra Jam is used in quite a lot of ingredients. You know what, I can get rid of that um, that mission now, can't I, to find the Gamma Root. And you do that by going into Log and just hitting Abandon Search. Done! Now, no more annoying messages telling you where the Gra... Well, the actual Gamma Planets are. I found the Gamma Planet. Thank you very much. Excess it. Nice. Anyhow, so yes, the Gra Jam is used in a lot of recipes, including donuts, ice creams, and the cakes. Yes, so you can make some delicious treats using Gra Jam. Heck yes, you can. Excellent. Right, so here we go. I'm going to jump back down to my kitchenette, and hopefully, yeah, because I might need to milk a creature or two if I want to make anything wondrous, like a cake. But yeah, you know what? I'm just going to show you guys how to make the Gra Jam. So one of the basic ingredients, but it's still quite a rare ingredient to be had. So here's my nutrient processor. Right, so now if I can get the Gra Berry, put the Gra Berry in. You'll see here, it just turns into processed sugar. You're thinking, well, how the fudge do I turn it into Gra Jam? Well, it's quite easy. If you just turn a couple, maybe half your quandary of the Gra Berry into processed sugar. There we go. I stop this when it gets to two. One, two, and buckle my shoe. And I just put that one over there. Look what it turns into. Ha <laughs> ha! Gra Jam! Who's the king of cooks? Heck yes! You can be the king of cooks. Yes, you can make yourself some gra jam. It's as easy as that. Jam diddly jam jam. Jam jam. Awesome! And we've got our gra berry. Got a little bit of surplus there. Could have turned it into sugar. Da 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 dum dum dum. Oh, sugar, sugar. Right, there we go. So that's now in my catalogue of things. And I've now just got myself a new item. There's my gra jam. Ha <laughs> ha, lovely. And yes, it's that simple, chum. So there we go. That's how you can make gra jam. And it's quite a rare product in a roundabout way since it only grows on the uh, you know, radiated gamma welds. So there we go, people. There we are. Gra jam can be yours and you can fill up your catalogue and make some bait goods. Until next time, you've been awesome. Goodbye, goodbye, and goodbye again. Well, thank you very much for watching. If you like what you see, please hit a like and a subscribe. And I'd like to say a massive great big thank you to all of my backers over on Patreon and over on YouTube membership. Thank you, new backers. And if you want to support this channel, just don't skip the adverts. Add Froze Revenue down my avenue. Or yeah, just stay with Captain Steve a little bit longer and hit something on this screen. There's merch here now too.